Ma'am, you've been talking about and actually working a lot about uh, giving back to society and your community work. Let's hear your thoughts on that and that aspect of your life also. Absolutely, if, if I may. Um, so again, you know, growing up in a school like Beacon House, um, we were always taught about giving back and helping others. There was a big emphasis on that. So that kind of stuck somewhere in my mind and my heart. And when I did my master's in religious studies, which was truly a turning point for me, it was like a 180 change in my life, a beautiful change. And I'm grateful for that. Um, I was developing my connection with Allah. And I met a humanitarian in Chicago who told me that that's only 50% of Islam. The rest of the 50% is helping Allah's beautiful creation. And I couldn't sleep after that two nights. I was like, he's, he's so right. And so everything kind of came together. And I was like, I want to volunteer for like, you know, some organization, a smaller one and help however I can. So Alhamdulillah, I joined Sharing Wonders, which is a UK-based um, uh, charity organization. And then I started working with them. And shortly after, the, co like, the pandemic happened. And when I was watching how Pakistan is being affected and the lockdown and daily wages especially, you know, it was very difficult for them. And so I just, I just wanted to do something. Um, so subhanAllah, you know, I, I wouldn't take any credit for this because this is truly from Allah and I was just made a catalyst. Mm -hmm. I just posted on my social media that, you know, I'm collecting funds for helping people like daily ration and even PPEs. So America had a lot of N95 masks and the world was in shortage. And so I said, anyone who wants to donate, you can directly send money to me and I will, you know, make it work because my family lives in Pakistan. And Allahu Akbar, I was able to raise thousands of dollars, mm. just single-handedly. People just sent me money. And then I, you know, I had friends who were working here. And because of that, we were able to, Alhamdulillah, Alhamdulillah, help so many people with food and medical equipment. And it was just, it was just beautiful to, to be able to do that, you know, sitting there. And, um, and I continue to do that now. You know, I work with Be The Change Pakistan. Be the Change Pakistan. And recently the, the brick kilns, they were shut down and people were, you know, suffering. So they, they needed school supplies and other stuff. So Alhamdulillah, I keep, you know, I, I'm, I'm like a fund collector. So give it to Beacon House for sure. For, for planted that seed. Planted that seed. Absolutely. 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 Alhamdulillah. Thank you so much for sharing this. Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah.